Uh, so this is going to be a little bit of a different kind of video here. You guys seem to enjoy when I load GTA 5 with the mod menu on my jailbroken PlayStation 4. So I'm going to be doing that in this video and it's going to be a little different. We have like an IRL type of point of view here. So let me go ahead and I'm going to connect my wires to my jailbroken PlayStation 4. This is my regular PlayStation 4 and then I have two jailbroken ones here. So every time I want to play with each different console, I got to switch over the cables. So let me go ahead and do that real quick and then I'll get back to this. All right, so I got the PS4 on right now. It's giving me signal. So we're ready to go basically. And uh, I switched over my PlayStation 4 that was originally on top of this one. I just moved it over so this one could breathe while it's on in the meantime. And that's also the reason why I don't have these caps on my PlayStation 4s. I don't have them on any of my PlayStation 4s just so they could breathe when I'm using them. So uh, yeah, we have the PlayStation 4 on. Let me go ahead and sit real quick and uh, we'll get into this. All right, so we're good now. This is going to be hard to do with one hand. So let's go ahead and press the PS button if it goes on. There we go. Let me see if I could hold the controller like this. So let's go ahead from here. Uh, we could just go into the internet browser real quick to load up the jailbreak. So let this load. There we go. And here's the jailbreak. It's called Hen. So let's just click on here. And basically once this loads, I can mod games. I could do all like modded stuff and uh, just basically like debug settings and all that. So it is now loaded. We could close out of here, go back into the internet browser. And now we can load the mod menu. So uh, on jailbroken PlayStation 4s, we actually have a section for GTA 5 mod menus, which is kind of cool. So we have all these menus we could use, uh, but my GTA 5 actually isn't updated. It's on the regular uh, version, which you get when you first download the game, which is just 1.0. So these 1.27 ones I can't use. So let me just use my favorite 1.0 mod menu real quick, which is called uh, Laman's menu. So let's go ahead and click on here. Let this load. That's pretty much it. The menu has loaded now. It'll tell me to open GTA. So there we go. Please launch GTA 5. So let's go over here. And there we go. I'll see you guys once I'm in the game. So another cool thing as it's loading, it's giving me notifications basically that everything worked properly setting up environment. I'll just let this go through, I guess. And you guys can see the next pop up as well. It'll tell me the mod menu name and how to open it, which is also a kind of cool notification that pops up. So I'll just wait for it real quick. Okay, so we should get it right there. There we go. Laments activated. Enjoy and uh, open D-pad right and square. It's pretty cool. So let me let this load and then I'll show you guys that we actually have the mod menu. All right, so we just loaded in. So let's go ahead and open this menu. D-pad right and square. There we go. It's hard to show it all in one like frame basically because like my camera's so zoomed in. I'm filming with an iPhone, but we have the mod menu loaded. It's pretty sick. I'll show you guys. I'm still on the PlayStation 4 as well. Let's go back in GTA. So... It's pretty cool and uh, it's a full functioning mod menu. Everything works. I'll turn on God mode real quick. I'll change my model since I'm already in here. We'll go to, we'll just change to an alien. So there we go. It said, please wait. So let me turn on God mode as well and I'll nade myself real quick. All right, so let's go ahead and drop a nade now. Show you guys the God mode works. It's pretty cool. I mean, you can't go online obviously, which doesn't really matter because the fact that we can just mod uh, GTA 5 on PlayStation 4. I think that's fun enough on story mode to be honest if this was possible online It'll definitely ruin the game. So it's just cool either way to just have offline So, uh, yeah, I mean that's pretty much it you guys seem to enjoy these kind of videos uh, In the thumbnail where it's just like an IRL video of like a picture of my screen with my hand in it or something like this Or whatever you guys seem to enjoy those like thumbnails So I guess why not make an actual video of an IRL of loading GTA 5 uh, with the mod menu on my jailbroken PlayStation 4. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this. Something different. I, I've been enjoying making videos on this channel. I appreciate you guys hanging out with me on this channel as well. So uh, yeah, we're almost getting to 8,000 subscribers. If you guys could subscribe to my channel, I would appreciate that. But uh, that's pretty much it. We're going to go ahead and end this video here. If you guys did enjoy this video, please drop a like. I would highly appreciate that. And uh, I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.